I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Sith Inquisitor, episode 19, and we're on Korriban! We need to go speak to Overseer Harkin, who, if you remember, all the way back from episode 1 and 2, would call me slave about 20 times a minute. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So let's go and be all like, hey, I'm a Sith, and what are you? Just an Overseer. Actually, is, that an, is an Overseer higher than what an actual Sith is? I have no idea, but I have more power than him, so let's just go with that, right? Yeah. Now, a couple of you are kind of worried a little bit because they've just revealed Knights of the Eternal Throne uh, when that's coming out. That's coming out November 29th of early on early access and December 2nd full release. And Bioware have said... Oh, I was going to say, why aren't walking working? Uh, Bioware have said that they are going to be stopping the Dark vs. Light event a week or so before Kotfi, Kotfi, Kotet arrives. So all in all, we've got about six weeks left. However, we've only got about four more planets to do. Now, bear in mind, I do two episodes a week, which pretty much summarizes an entire planet. That's kind of been my plan ever since I started this series. And I've always said from the start that this would be more for the class story and do as many objectives as I possibly can before the Dark vs. Light event finishes. Now, I've kind of got there, to be fair. Um, I have got some packs to open for at the end of the series. Um, where am I actually at in terms of the achievements for the Dark vs. Light? I've got a lot more to do and I do plan to do some in my own time. So we're, we're going to get to this. This one's going to be done, no problem. Especially now that they've got double XP going on all the way up until the uh, release of Kotet. So that's even better. So we're going to get that even faster. And then of course there's this, which I told you a long time ago what I'm going to do is once I've done level 50, once I've reached level 50 uh, and done the class story, then I would do as many of these objectives as I can in my own time and then come back and show you what's in the packs. <laughs> you gotta think, an entire series just to show you what, about six minutes of content? Eh, but you know, it'd be like another pack opening video, wouldn't it? So that's kind of exciting. Um, I hear the Datacron, but I've already got it so I don't need it again. Oh wait, I was gonna say, I don't need to go all the way around, I can just jump down because Harkon is down here in my class phase. Oh. Oh, and if you've forgotten why I need to even go to Overseer Harkon, uh, I kind of lost my apprentices. They they kind of died. So I need to go get myself a not new your one. Time yet. No, indeed it's not. Let's go pick out a new apprentice, shall we? You are the slime, the filth, the wretches of society. You are what Sith Lords scrape off their boots. I don't know why the Sith Empire even bothers with you, miserable curs. Are you like to do everyone? Why is it to give you shovels and have you dig your own graves? Ah, uh, still the same jerk. Oh, Harkon. Good to see you haven't changed one bit. Well, well, my lord. I certainly never expected to see you again. My lord. I was just preparing these new slaves for their imminent death. Exciting. Are you here for an apprentice, or were you just feeling nostalgic? Kind of both. A little bit of both. I'm certainly not here to see you. Still as prickly and arrogant as ever, eh, slave? I mean, my lord. Yeah. Hanaton had the sense to pass up this cancerous lot, so they're yours if you want them. This worm is Sephiroth. They found him in a hut's palace, crushing prisoners' heads for the hut's entertainment. Sounds like my kind of guy. It's a pleasure to meet you, my Shut lord. Up, slave. You don't talk directly to a lord of the Sith unless she asks it. This beady-eyed monstrosity is Argog. Don't know where on a cat hound's backside he's supposed to come from. Not far from where you were born, I think. Sorry, what was that? Can't understand a word it says. This gangly creature is Jackson. He's no Sith, but is at least human. No offense. And this bone-faced one, well, I can't pronounce whatever gibberish he says he's called. We call him Zalek. Master. Don't let him fool you. Too wild for his own good. There were two others, but we made the mistake of leaving them alone with Zalek. I caution you against choosing favorites, Harkon. I will check in often. You may check back as you please. I don't expect it to take too long to chew through this bunch. What are you staring at, wretches? You know your trial. Now go! Oh, do I not get to choose right now? Oh, okay. 
I mean, I know which one we're going to choose, because we're not exactly choosing, it's just, oh, hey, um, you sort of get to choose, but you get this guy. So, yeah. Hi, Harkin. Oh. Okay, um, so I get to come out whenever I choose, eh? I want to come out now. I want to come back now! Let us use the intercom, and then we'll head our way to Hoth, I believe. I trust our friend Harkin is doing well. If your business is finished on Korriban, it's time we looked for another spirit to bind. I hope you've turned up more than rumors. One man's rumors are another man's force fortifying ghosts. We think what Andronicus has heard is true. A Republic transport crashed over Hoth about a year ago. It was carrying artifacts from a Sith tomb that the Jedi had confiscated. About a year ago. Sorry, I know it's about a week ago, but I just couldn't resist. Confiscated is the perfect euphemism, isn't it? A Sith is in no place to judge. The Jedi never recovered the transport. I don't like the idea of binding the dead like this, but if you have to, I'd start looking for that transport. Oh, that was an easy cutscene. Okay, let's go to Hoth! Um, ooh, I thought we were going to reach level 30. The, the game froze for like a split second, so I thought, Oh, we've reached level 39! No, sorry, sorry, Charlie. Sorry. Stop exploding! In fact, before we go to Hoth, let's speak to Ashara uh, some more. I'm realizing there's a lot I don't understand about the Empire. I don't expect a Jedi to understand. But the Empire is strength and freedom. They certainly talk a lot about strength, but freedom? From what I've seen, that belongs to a select few. Slavery is everywhere. And even among the so-called free, only the Sith act with any sort of independence. How can you support an Empire that actively enslaves and spits on your people? Uh... People like us need to work harder to overcome our natural disadvantages. What? You actually believe that you're inferior to humans? Well, the original yeah. Sith weren't human. Their whole attitude toward aliens is built on a lie, so they can control you. You shouldn't have to compromise who you are. You don't have to stay, you know. You could go to the Republic. I can do far more good among the Sith than I can as a Jedi. I want to believe that. It just seems like the deck is stacked against us. They hate aliens so much. I'm worried they can only fear you. Never respect you. You forget, Ashara. There appears to be more humans in the universe, it, well, in the Star Wars galaxy, than there appears to be any other alien. I mean, have you not watched the Star Wars movies? I mean, it's human after 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 human. Then there's a little bit of a gungan. Then there's a human. There's a human. There's a human. There's a human. 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 Little bit of a droid. Human, 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 and then there's like a Wookiee in there somewhere. So yeah, that's that's basically Star Wars. Yeah, it's it's filled with humans. I hope you found some more information on this ghost business, Andronicus. Look, I've been doing some digging around, and by all accounts, this stuff is more messed up than Tatooine. Pirates run this place, though the Empire and the Republic have dared to move in of late. Still, ships don't land here. The cold is part of it. But there are other rumors. The kind you'd ignore if you had sense. There's nothing sensible about looking for a ghost in a frozen wasteland. Yeah, I guess if I wanted sense, I should have stuck with killing and stealing. There was a light freighter out of Yavin 4, Star Runner, disappeared over this place. Reported some strange happenings before it did. It was a smuggler vessel, loaded full of ancient junk from Yavin's tombs. If I wanted to catch a ghost, I'd start asking after that ship. Hope you've got your blasters ready. Just finishing the cold weather fittings, and I'll be ready. Hollow Chatter says the Empire's operating on this ice block, so you might try using your new Lord of the Sith authority. Careful, though. Place is crawling with pirates, and they aren't all as nice as me. Why do you think I brought a pirate along? You know, pirate place for a pirate guy. Not gonna lie, that loading screen took about a minute and a half. No idea why it took so long, but thanks, game. Appreciate it. Not really. Oh, we've got some new abilities. Last, a worthy disciple. Indeed, we've got passive ability. Lovely. Uh, purges or hostile. Uh, I'll keep that by. Assassinate. Tips assassinate target. Only at 30%. Yep. Need that. Where you, you go. 
that, you can go there, 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 and there. I always like to keep like Be that gone. ability at the very end of my toolbar, and stuff can just remain there. Because why not? Sergeant Loren, where art thou? Thou there. I'm looking for a ship called the Star Runner. My lord, truly an honor and a surprise. Surprise! I'm afraid no ships have landed on Hoth in ages, unless it's a crash. Actually, the name Star Runner sounds familiar. If I may ask, what do you need the ship for? You're here on Darth Thanason's behalf, naturally. Uh, yes, of course. The Star Runner was, uh, shipping artifacts that belonged to him. Indeed, yeah, yeah. Totally. Strange. Yeah. The vessel, I recall, was a Republic ship. Star Runner. Blast. Your ship crashed years ago. It's buried under a few tons of snow by now. Your best bet? No. Give me a few months to get a recovery team on it. Excuse me? I'm afraid you may be dead in a few months. Is there a faster solution? Well, I mean, there's an Imperial Reclamation Service team you could take command of, if you wanted. It's just, the lieutenant in charge is a little odd. Too much time digging in tombs, you understand. I hope you plan to elaborate. They say Lieutenant Talos Drelik is very particular about his work, takes it extremely seriously. I'm afraid I can't call Lieutenant Drelik. The weather on Hoth is bad for communications. The team's way out in the way searching for some mythical Sith temple on Hoth of all places. Good luck, my lord. Yep, I always need the luck. Talos, where art thou? You're there. Let's go meet you so that you can do your business on Hoth and then get your but on my ship. I mean, he's he's not gonna be a companion. No, 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 no. Spoilers. Wait, I got some more abilities. What dark secret oh, shall I oh, with you? rank three. How exciting! Damn you, elevator. Yeah, you get your ass down here, elevator. Go up without me, Frisky Tatana. What? What the? Whoa! Whoa! Are you kidding me right now? I mean, thanks. I'm back. I'm up here where I need to be, but I fell through the cracks. Oh my god, that is absolutely insane. Hey, where do I need to go? Oh, still got a little further to travel. Why well, couldn't just be right in there? That would have saved me a load of time. Wampa, hi Wampa. The bitter end, eh? Uh, I'm guessing there's like, yes, yes, please don't let there be any enemies that can kill me. Oh my god, I'm so low on health, I better go into stealth. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh good, I was going to say it rhymed, but good, they're, they're, um, people who won't hurt me. Oi! Talos! Need your help! We're close, boys. We'll find that temple, I can feel it. Rogers, no cutting corners. Don't forget the salt. Salt's not the best solution. But it's the only thing that doesn't freeze out here, and solid footing is a must. I thought I was crazy. Oh, my lord, you can never be too cautious. The dead dislike having their graves rifled, even for posterity. I heard you single-handedly unearthed artifacts of the great Tulak Horde. I'm a Naga Sadar man myself, but I'd love to compare notes. What brings you to Hoth, and how may I be of service? Well... I'm hunting a ghost, actually. On a crashed ship. Hmm. A ship. Not usually our line, but let's hear it. Maybe we can help. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. A bit new for the reclamation service. But artifacts. And a ghost. I've heard that the dead talk down in the tombs, but to see one, oh. I wonder if it'd be possible to make a hollow image. I imagine it would depend on the light. <laughs> yes. Darker would be better. Engineer Sorrel, do we have any probes that aren't frozen solid? Shalora works as good as any in these conditions, sir. She may not look like much, but she's got heart. If my guess is correct, the captain would have launched a distress beacon before the crash, which would give us a line on the ship. Aren't you supposed to be in the Imperial military? We do a more conceptual sort of soldiering. We fight the dark army of forgetting that threatens our history. My boys and I are going to shift camp. Try to get a better communication set up going. But let us know if you find anything. Thanks, Talos. 
That, that's great. Great. We've got to do all the work as usual. Wait, where the hell am I even going? Uh, got there. Oh, okay. So I need to go back anyway. Should I? Mm, should I quick travel to the fort? No, no, don't do that. So where am I going? I've got to go up this way. I imagine so, because it is pointing me up there. You all good, guys? Good. Guys. Uh, ooh, nearly got attacked by the banker cat. Attempted to find bearing. Signal to... What? I'm right on top of it. Oh, I actually got a kill. Oh, I could have just gone stealth and mind trapped you. Oh, well. Let's get some, some experience, I guess. Why not? Right, I'm bloody on top of it. Find it. Locked on signal and found bearing. Cool. Now I need to do the second bearing, which is... That way. Whoa! Steady on, mate! You're going far too fast. Okay, I think this time I will actually go into stealth. Uh, because I want to mind maze you. And then we should still be on top of where we need to be. Please lock onto it, lock onto it, lock onto it. Yeah! Uh, triangulate the beacon's coordinates over there. Not too far. Oh, level 39 just by exploring. Beautiful. wonder how quickly I'll get to level 40. I need to go that way. Where am I going? Transmitting beacon. Recover the distress here. beacon, which is that way now. We're going from place to place to place to place to place. Wow. It's an exciting video this, isn't it? Okay. Oh, that's bigger than I thought it was. This is Captain Quillen of the Star Runner. SOS. I repeat, SOS. S -O -S. We're caught in Hoth's gravitational pull and falling fast. Strange events date back two weeks. Yavin 4 artifacts believed to be the source. Something has taken control of the ship. To whomever finds this message, burn this vessel. Don't look inside. Don't touch it. Burn it. Lieutenant Drellick really is something else. Could find a Wampa here in a snowdrift, I bet. Do you expect me to get excited about a distress beacon? Well, it confirms the existence of your ghost, for one. And these tracks might mean something. Lieutenant, sir. We found the beacon, but no ship. There's some light tracks, though. They appear to be a few days old. Have Shalora zoom in, Sorrel. I've been studying alien <laughs> tracks since I was old enough to know a Twi'lek from a Tukata. Um, Ortolan. I'd know them if they were six days old and covered in jam. Those are Ortolan tracks. I'd know them if they were six days old and covered in jam. Well, at least I know they have jam in the Star Wars universe. I'll be sure to look for you next time my ship's galley is invaded by a pack of Ortolans. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. I'll have to remember that next time the Imperial Reclamation Service Trackers Committee meets. It looks like those Ortolans dug something up. Possibly a clue to the ship's location. Sorrel, where's the nearest Ortolan camp? It's a ways beyond the next outpost. But the tracks look headed in the right direction. Well, it might be time to put on your best diplomatic face, my lord. Ortolans don't like outsiders much. But it looks like they're the key to finding our ghost. I'm already wearing my diplomatic face. But, you know, I'm getting tired of this. This chase better give results, or I'll have your skin for a cloak. Never so much as a pottery shard has escaped me, my lord. We are on the right track. I'll have Sorrel bring the beacon to the base. Between it and the Ortolans, we're bound to have a breakthrough. We'll be there when you're through dealing with the Ortolans. I love how I just threatened his life, and he's all like, Ah! Don't worry about it. Ha, ha, ha. Really? Only three bars? I thought I was going to get more bars than that. Uh-oh. Nearly got seen. Saw. So, I don't know. Whatever the word is. <sighs> I'll get to legendary status someday. Someday. I mean, I have the live and legend title, which I believe you get for uh, getting legacy level 50. Yes, I'm living legend, as you can so well see. Oh, oh, hi! Hi, Ortolans! Have you got any jam? I was told to bring my bread. Ooh, a bonus mission which would be easy. Do I get a lot from this? 23,000 compared to... 20... What?! I almost get as much to do the bonus mission than I do for the main mission. 
Wow, what a ripoff. Go, cool, bonus mission done. Wow, we're, we're halfway there now. Uh, I'm going to go stealth because I don't need to kill any more. No. Good, Ortolan. Uh, Ortolan Chief. Howdy. I'm looking for the remains of a ship called the Star Runner, which you took from the Distress Beacon site. Who are you? Must you outlanders claim every slab of ice on Hoth? Drive the stranger away! Hound her through the snow until she squeals! You will do no such thing! The master speaks! I'm Horak Mo, right hand of Luna Kresh, the true Dark Lord of the Sith. Or what's left of him. Could you say that again? Do not play stupid with me. I am Horak Mo, Sith Lord Looks like that we was. Found our ghost. So you want me to pop this blue thing in the skull so you can bind this guy? I know what you are for, Schooler. Your last victim writhes, writhes, writhes within your mind. But I will not be bound. Surely I can persuade you otherwise. I've never taken no for an answer, and it would be shame to start now. Do you really think you can challenge me? It took five of Nagasado's assassins to kill me. Not one, but five. I hold my freedom, dear Sith. If you wish to buy me, it would take more than words. I wonder if Jedi have this much trouble getting what they want. Buried deep in the snows of Hoth, you will find the ruins of an ancient Sith temple. The temple was both training ground and burial site for Nagasado's personal order of assassins, the assassins who murdered me. Become the instrument of my revenge, and I will consider divulging my location and sharing my strength. And how exactly do I enact revenge on ancient dead assassins? Do what it seems. Do what it seems you do best. Destroy. The temple is lined with complicated traps, and these animals have no talent for thinking. I hope you're different, but I won't mourn you. Desecrate the temple. Destroy the relic. Every bone. Every ornament. Bauble. Yeah. Mouse has spoken. Leave us, Outlander. Sorry, I'm not called the Outlander until I get to Kotfei. Well. I mean, Kralatoka is the main outlander, but you know, you gotta love it. It kind of makes no sense. I've got to go up to go down. I know, right? I mean, I know it's probably, it's probably just like an area I can't cross, but I just find it funny. But of course, I'm not going to walk all the way there. I'm gonna take myself a taxi. Because I'm a cheater. Not, not in terms of relationship. If I ever find uh, the, my one true love, I would never cheat on them, but. I, 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 I. Shut up! Why can't you drop me there? Now I gotta go all the way over there. Ah! I'm back, Talos. I said back. We weren't here in the I first place. I the ghost, and he needs me to get inside an ancient temple. Then it's true. My peers in the service laughed when I said it was on Hoth, but now, yes, it's the only thing that makes sense. Your ghost said he was a follower of Ludo Kresh, and that Naga Sadao's assassins killed him. Sith. Do you realize what you've done? Ooh, sure, I'm yawning. Um, I could flirt with him. Not gonna, but I could. Can you get me inside, or can't you? I wouldn't miss a discovery like this for all the scrolls of a dark temple. We're talking about the fabled Sadoin, Naga Sadao's personal order of assassins. Myth made real. Don't worry, I'll get you inside. I've been circumventing the security of ancient tombs since I was old enough to hold a data spike in a pair of pliers. Then shut up and get me into that temple. Yes, my lord. With pleasure. And now we have Talos as our companion. That looks like it hurt. Eh, not really. Ooh, I'll take that. Thank you. I would definitely take that. How much experience will I get for the next one? 61,000! Um... That'll get me to level 40! But we won't do this until the next episode. So, um... Again, probably a short episode. All of these episodes have been short, but I'm finishing them quite quickly. Um, and a lot of the stuff which I cut out is just all... Empty stuff. And then they turn into like 20 minute videos. So, I, I can't... I, I, you know... It's just the way it is. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I... 
shall see you next time. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And a farewell to you.